surely that was unavoidable. <laughs> we're probably gonna get uh we're probably gonna get good Laura in this because this is probably before Mark died. Not Mark. I wonder if this is gonna be how he died. At least I think we're on good terms right now. Where's Martin? I told him to go do the dishes. Oh. During your attack, he didn't know what to do with himself, so I gave him something to do. You got it. He really cares about you. He's never seen me like that. But you had asthma when you were little. I was different. And I had it under control by middle school. When did he come back? came back when our mom died. Dad? I don't remember. She walks so fast. It is... It's 2024. We need to make sure that we have the AI walking speeds down at this point, or the NPC walking speeds. She's walking faster than me. Please don't tell my dad about the asthma attack. My lips are sealed. She does walk a little bit sassy. I agree. Well, let's go. Man, she looks- Laura looks so happy. We have such good relationship. You see last night's game? A clown show. I mean, it'll be a miracle if they make the playoffs. Hey, Alex, single or double? Single. Thanks, Robert. I live to serve. And don't you forget it. Never mind, Queen. <laughs> oh. How you doing, Dad? Good birthday so far? Dad? Hmm? Fine, sweetheart. I'm, I'm fine. Uh, are you alright? You look pale. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I just, um... Alex, you mind grabbing a beer? Not at all. Was oh, that a ping pong table? What do you say, birthday boy? You want one? No, oh, thanks. We got, we got collectibles in this chapter, though. And it better be full when he gets here. Just because you're in college doesn't mean you're legal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Settle down. On the front of the birthday card featuring a drawing of an old dog. Wait, you're turning how old? <laughs> Woof, that's rough. Handwritten. Oh, it's from Laura. Kenneth, happy birthday. I'm not great at sentiment, but I hope you know that Robert and I will always be here to help when times are tough and to celebrate the next 45 birthdays. I hope you like your present. A multi... What? Remember? <laughs> okay. I'm trying to... First year, Ken. College. Oh. She's always been inventive. What was it that everyone called her when she was little? A tuneful technician. <laughs> That's it. Julia gave her that nickname. <clears throat> and Martin, he just finished, what, his third year? Yeah, yeah, he'll be flying in no time. Hush, I don't like thinking about him driving a car, let alone flying a plane. Uh huh. Trying to make sure I got everything straight. So Robert and Laura are together. I think those are both of Martin's parents. That's where we're going to put the beer. Gosh, dude. Anybody that's listening to me right now, I would absolutely farm you in ping pong. Although, I, admittedly, it has been a long time since I've played. Holy. Written in red pen. Martin, here's the album you wanted when you're done. Bring it back inside. I don't want it just sitting in the shed. Mom. Yep, we will do. Martin. Okay. Spring 2008. There's no way to flip these over, is there? No, there's not. Oh, 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 we need a, oh, okay. So we need the, we need the combo. Autumn 2010, summer 2009. Notes for Alex's birthday puzzle. Get photos from album done. One of my dad's little briefcases. Carve numbers done. Make sure puzzle works. Get gift to put in briefcase. Write birthday note to Alex. How her birthday is always the anniversary of our friendship. She always my best friend. Ask her out. Is it weird to do that on a birthday note? Okay, so carve the numbers. I feel like they're I feel like they're numbers carved. Is that supposed to be our clue? What do we think? I might just need to come back to it. It's probably not that big a deal. 
I mean, there are only 999 options. I can get that down here in just a couple minutes. No, we'll just grab the beer. We'll just grab If we find it, we find it. Not a big deal. Whoa. Alex never it might be the first rifle we've ever seen. Maybe the years numbers from the years on the photos. Maybe. That was three different years though, right? If we can Alex, can I talk to you for a sec? Oh. Okay, I can't keep moving. Yeah, I tell you what, let's go. Yeah, let's take a look at the photos again. Maybe it does have to do. I, I I feel like he said carve the numbers though, so I feel like here's the album you wanted. So it's 2008, 2010, 2009. I don't know what that would be though. I, yeah, I have, no, I have no idea. I have no idea. Please don't ignore me. I'm sure I'm gonna have to come kind of play back through this game to get all the trophies and stuff anyway. Boss man. Aw. Hey. Hi. I just wanted to say. I'm, I know. Like, really sorry. I, I didn't know that you. It's okay, really. I just. I, th I thought you'd laugh. You know. On the plus side, you get to brag to all your friends at school. I do? Yeah. You can tell them that you finally took a girl's breath away. Alex wow. has Riz. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to say it, but I kind of missed you this year. Yeah? Yeah. Martin, I can't find the bottle opener. Can you? On it. <sighs> Want to help me look? Sure. Aww. All right. Gosh, I know I said we'd move on, but I can't stop thinking about the, the code for that briefcase now. Maybe the code will be in here somewhere. You must always be attentive. A spaceship. So big, bro. I feel like we're finding... I don't, I don't know. Oh, has he gotten even cuter? Hello. This is day one. That's... A sack of vinyl records. I don't really care too much about those. Hey, uh, I don't suppose they could use a hammer instead? Not unless they want bits of glass in their beer. Ooh, crunchy beer. Oh, I can't go upstairs. Um, I feel like we've gotten a good amount of the collectibles, but I could be wrong. The the spaceships. Lots of hunt. Okay. Yep. Yep. Can't look at that. Oh, well, we got these two. Yep, we get it. They are awesome. They're very well educated. They're awesome. Can't open that. Red velvet cake. That sounds so good, dude. I'm also just hungry. I'm streaming early for you guys today, so I didn't have time to make myself lunch. Holy shit. I can't believe you have this. It's my mom's. Do you have any idea how rare this is? You think I'd like it? If you like my music, you'll love theirs. They're like my biggest inspiration. Can I hear it? Uh, will Laura mind if we play it? I meant your music. What? what Come on. It's been a long time since I've heard you sing. You mean now or? <laughs> Why not? I mean, I just wasn't planning on it and I haven't warmed up or. <sighs> no, screw it. All is quiet, all is calm, though the storm isn't gone. See the sun, catch my breath, for when all what comes next, for just a moment, I feel warm. In the eye of a storm. Alex. Um... Anyway, if you liked that, you're gonna love their stuff. Maybe Alex doesn't so have cool Riz. Have it on vinyl. I, I, I want to show you something. Uh, 
it's probably just me i always upstairs i always like i don't know even when people are so much for the bottle opener will you slow down hold on do you want to give me another asthma attack hey i'm always down to take your breath away I feel like even if people are really talented, there is part of me that I don't maybe it's just me, maybe it's not, but I just there is part of me that always cringes when people sing in front of other people. Like not in like a structured setting. Like if it's like a concert or something, like that's awesome. But just I don't know. Just like raw singing for someone else. I just I don't know. I can't find the um the, the hook ladder thing. You see it anywhere? I think it might be in my bed. Wait here. I'll get it. Oh no 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 no. This time, I'll run off. And who knows? I might even plan some incredibly stupid prank. Oh, God. I thought you were over that. What's the point of opening this? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm not. What is the... Why, why are we able to open up this door if there's not going to be anything in here? That's dumb. Yeah, if any... I have, I've only seen A Quiet Place Day 1. I did really... I did not really like it. And so, if you have seen the movies, if there's any little nuggets of, like, Easter eggs or things like that, let me know, because I'll... I obviously missed it. All about balance. Laura, an author? Laura is very, very good at her job. As we finish our meal, I ask Miss Edwards one final question. Oh, no, no, they're interviewing Laura. If nature did achieve balance, would you stop hunting? She smirks. As she finishes the final bite of flank steak, balance is never passive. It's active, made up of acts of violence and acts of love, moments of tenderness and moments of despair. And with that, Miss Edwards finishes her steak. I could go in either of these doors. Let's just go in this one. Actually, let's open them first. See what's in both of them. Which one do we feel like is Martin's bedroom? That one screams Martin's bedroom. So we will go into the parents' bedroom. Not for prying eyes. Please do not read. From Robert. Space Haze by Robert Edwards. I don't, I'm not really going to read this. I hope that's okay. I had the tuna. Okay. There's a train, but it's well-worn tracks did not lead to the city. This train ran around the clock too. <gasps> we may never know. Most trains carry commuters. This train was different. It was special. We did, is this guy writing like Thomas the Tank Engine right now? Printed from Kenneth. I apologize for emailing you like this. I just saw you at work. But honestly, I couldn't bring myself to ask you face to face. Julia's treatment is sucking us dry. I'm putting my hand on the card. I'm hoping you could give us a loan. I'll pay back every cent and with interest. I wouldn't ask, but if there's any hope of saving your oof. How much can we get? Oh. So yeah, so I'm trying to make sure I understand. Kenneth is Alex's dad. Our mom died. Like, we're, this is this is this is after she died. That's what this means. So the yeah, Julia passed away, and Martin's parents right now are Laura and Robert. And I'm assuming. I think we're supposed to assume that something happened to Robert, and that is why Laura really has a tough relationship with us now i feel like that's i feel like that's do you guys agree mrs edwards while mr riley appreciates our offer of 250k as compensation for the injury we believe this sum does not account for the severe emotional trauma he suffered <laughs> when we agreed to settle out of court as contingent on you compensating with the sum that not only covered his medical bills but also took into account his reduced quality of life on my client's behalf i request you send over a new offer in the next 30 days we'll have no choice to take it to court okay i wonder what that's about we got more a stack of books I just, I, I, I'm just here to get the collectible. How many do we have? We've got 19 of 24. We are missing a mixtape. I feel like the mixtape is going to be in the briefcase. And I just feel like we don't have what it takes to get it, unfortunately. Although maybe, I'm sure, I'm sure we got some goodies in here. How many times have you seen Revenge of the Bloodsuckers 2 now? 50? 60? Mm, more like uh, 120. Haha, <laughs> Martin. Always the jester. Ooh, guitar man. All right, all right. Oh, can I play this? Dude, let me play this. Martin Chow. Sorry for the super random. I was thinking about you. Who's this from? Who's this from? <gasps> it's from Alex. Let's read this. Just because I go everywhere in Italy, I think Martin would totally love this. Mom and dad took me on a gondola ride, which at first was super awk because I felt like the third wheel on a date with my parents, barf. But then I started thinking about the time we went fishing and he pranked me and I fell into the water. And I can't imagine a better revenge than pushing you off a gondola in Venice as the gondolier in all of Italy watch. Hee hee hee. Oh, have you heard any Italian trap? It's this music I've never even heard of. It's mellow, but has a sick beat, and it's sad, but super pretty. I think you'd dig it. There's so much more I want to tell you, but that's going to have to wait for when I see you. And you may be getting a present, so you'll definitely want to see me. Now that I'm going to be in high school, I'm so old. We'll be able to hang out during lunch again, but not as old as you. So yeah, I'm missing you, I guess. 
this letter just screams like it was written by a 40 year old trying to write for a like a, a, a like a 16 year old you know what i mean like i don't know i don't know in my mind that does not feel genuine can i not can i really not play this let me play it i like the music though is there no other i was kind of counting on martin having a lot of documents in this room i don't think it's gonna happen though you can carry a hook ladder connected to a suspended ladder. Ooh, that feels like that's gonna be, that feels like that's gonna be applicable back when we get to the present day. Yep, attach. There we go. Oh, I have to manually do it. All right, understood. All right. There's so much crap up here. Well, you know what they say. One man's crap is another man's final collection. I see a spaceship. Spaceship! Money! Yeah, I feel like we've gotten a good amount of spaceships. I think they give you a different amount of credits depending on how hard it is to find them. Happy essay by Martin. Who is Martin? Martin's our boy. Martin's Martin's our Martin's our Martin's our boo. Miss Costello told the class to write an essay about what at school makes us happy so we can think about we so we can think about that as we get ready for middle school. And this is my essay. Miss Costello said we should write about math or English. But what makes me happy is my friends, Alex and Austin, sitting next to them in homeroom, eating with them at lunch, playing Space Invaders with them at recess. That's what makes me happy, and it's going to keep me happy in middle school, and that's what my essay is about my friends and not math. The end. What a short essay, Martin. That's all we can do. That's all we can muster up. What is... What? Okay. Is that what I'm... I'm that might be what I'm supposed to look at. I feel like that's what I'm supposed to look at. Let's do it. Whoa. How long have you had these? You like them? They're incredible. Which one's your favorite? Jesus. Huh? Oh, right. Just uh, pretend they don't exist. That's what I do. They're all your mom's? Yep. I know she likes to hunt, but this is... What? A lot. I mean, she doesn't like hunting. She doesn't? She does <laughs> it for work. I thought she worked in, like, uh, wildlife management. Yeah, which sometimes means population control. Population control. If, you know, a species gets out of hand, she says it's the only way to, like, um, maintain... We read the interview. We know this. You hear that? What? Oh. could have done. I'm a doctor. What's the point if I can't save my own wife? The hell is that? Oh, uh, yeah, okay. There's a big you can see that like that was like a central meteor or whatever. I really need to watch the first two movies, dude. I feel like I, I loved the I love the idea of I didn't love day one. I don't even remember that much about it. I just remember being really bored watching it. We got the lake house. Let's go. Oh, crap. We're back to the present. Bro, just give me like flash. Oh, I gotta be quiet now. The National Guard is near, but can I really trust them? Will they help me? Can they? With those things out there, no place to save. I have no better option. What a picture that we drew. Oh. You can only teabag very efficiently in this game. Heart is starting to, to race. Oh, yeah, we need. Oh, 
there's no way. There's no way I make that. And ten toys. Let's go. Okay. okay. Oh, something must have happened here. The place looks deserted, but I saw a light. What if it's a trap? What if it's Laura? I can't ignore it. I gotta check it out. Yeah. I feel like we're at the point where we need to put personal feelings about Laura aside. Like, are we, like, like, really? I don't know. What's this? It's what you might be thinking. Carrie, you met when we interviewed. I met who you were before you came to Omar the Otter's Outdoor Adventure Camp. What a mouthful. Everyone leaves a different person. How can I make such a bold claim? The Otter Way. <laughs> Only put out positivity, thank nature for its gifts, try harder, expect greatness, remember to have fun. If you embrace the otter way, I promise you'll discover the real you. It's about my aunt. To put on my boss hat, it's your job to champion the otter way. Being a kid has never been more confusing. Social media consumes kids' lives, but not at Omar the Otter's Outdoor Adventure Camp. <laughs> you will help our campers connect with nature maybe for the first time. The first step in embracing will be the most difficult turn in your cell phones. It seems extreme, but when they arrive, you'll have to collect their phones and it will keep a critical few still ideas on you. Bring your friends to the Adam Building by three. I know we'll have an utterly fantastic summer. Carrie West. Carrie, I'm feeling way too much pep on me right now. This. Found a bear trap. Yes, a bear trap. I was able to set off by throwing a bottle. It made a super loud noise. I'm surprised that we can't make sure I was okay. Utterly unacceptable. We must do a full sweep before the camp. Interesting. They're dead. Every single counselor. The campers aren't here yet, but Freddy, Billy, Jason, even Carrie, all killed. I have to try to reach someone to get help. Only Carrie knew the code of the safe with all the phones in it, so I have to make for the radio station. If I don't make it, I hope someone finds this. Tell them my parents, Sid and Lori Carpenter, that I tried to get back to them. I tried. Gail. I wonder if any of these are references to the first two movies. No crying, no screaming. I hate that it I hate that it faces me towards the wall and I have to turn around. Every single time that happens, I feel like I'm gonna get jump scared. Air traps can be diffused by throwing objects, they're noisy, so be careful. That makes sense. Yep, okay. I just take I mean, I, ha I have to. We are swaying a lot.
Aaron, Josh, how old are you? Five, eight. You with my mom, dad, what's your teddy bear's name? Dad. Dad says playing's dangerous. Like, kids, I admit, again, not that I'm the most in tune with how five and eight year olds write, but there's no way you spell says or dangerous. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Kind of object. We're going in. There's someone in here. I feel like this is Kenneth. Oh, thank God. Are you? I'm fine. Yeah, it was uh, an accident. Did, did Laura do that? And the hospital was attacked. And everything happened so quickly. Did anyone else make it out? All that matters is that you're safe. So now. Laura followed me. She's not well. <laughs> yeah. Locking you up. Oh, I never thought. Alex. She knows. About. Your glove. Shred to shred. Oh, that's okay. Oh, no. Here, put these on. No, we're yeah, not going to do that. Yeah. Don't be silly. I'm not. Oh, Alex. I'm sorry. I, I, I just, I can't. No crying. He was my, my only. And he's gone. This game looks amazing, by the way. to clip the sound traps the show what well i just remembered laura got me this for my birthday i found these i can direct you to the antenna i can talk but you need to stay quiet i know okay tap the mic once for yes Twice for no. Got it? Good. Be safe. You too. There's a Christian radio station I was I used to listen to a ton growing up, and they would always say be safe and be hope filled. I feel like there's just a it's like a gut reaction in me when I hear be safe. I just want to say and be hope filled. There we go. Dad is alive. His leg is injured, but he's alive. I don't know for sure what happened to him. It doesn't matter. Not anymore. All I want is to fix the antenna and figure out where the National Guard is heading and find a safe place for us. That took me a second. That took me a second. When I entered the camp, I noticed a sound trap. If you use the multi-tool to cut the rope, you can deep. Oh, well, I'm... <laughs> Every trap will require you to press R1 or hold L2, R2 in different patterns. That's confusing. That's confusing. Okay. That's hard. 
that's hard. If I go to the right, or do I get a mixtape? I, I I I can't not go over here. Did you go left? You never did like being told what to do. Just like your mother. That's cool. Thanks for the info. Did you go left? So this is odd. The path traced on the map seems to go through a bunch of rocks. I guess check to see if there's a passage. Can he see it?
I'm so nervous. I'm so freaking nervous. Alex, are you alright? Please tell me you're alright. Oh, thank God. Alright, now go to the tower and figure out what's wrong with the antenna. You know, fight her, Alex. Just like her. You're stronger than you think. Game was screwed because when the power goes out, you need to restart it in the warehouse. It's our only option for powering the wall. We need to get in the warehouse. Is this loud? I can't climb over this. Are you serious right now? Louder? I might need to be on I understand. Oh. Surely that was unavoidable. <laughs> Buddy dove in and swung. That's crazy. Dude, I had no idea. I thought for sure that that was like a mandatory cutscene. That's why, dude. <laughs> Birds sing, musicals and singing. I've seen the film. She was chill with kids. Asked her what she wants to do. Back Where everyone has been for eight years. Every time I hear her to be completely and utterly wrong. A lot of people make this world cool. Like you. Oh. She wants to have ashes. I don't blame the monsters. I blame you. Third, I actually want the Raiders to do everything. Still alive, that means you stole something from someone who needed it, who died without it. But you're not going to get away with it. The National Guard is left, and now it's just you and me. I want you to avoid the first trap, the second, and the third. I want you to believe you will get out of here alive. I want you to hope, and then I want you to know how it feels when hope dies. Wow. I'm out of inhalers. There's another 
Schweißstange. Shoot! Shoot! How did I miss that one? No. That is tough. Dang it, dude. That was really tough. I burned through all of my inhalers on that, too. I can't believe it just went through all of my inhalers so fast. I was so well stocked. I still don't think we've hit a save. I'm so dead without an inhaler, dude. This is gonna tire me out. I feel like this is the equivalent of being one in this game.
Hold, hold. It worked. I was right. The National Guard left for the town of Clinton to get on boats and sail for an island where the creatures can't reach them. What's important is that we have a direction, even hope. Okay, back to dad. Creatures cannot swim. I repeat, the creatures cannot swim. This is Task Force Empire to all available units. If you're receiving this message, convene at the harbor in Clinton. Did you hear that? How long has it been since they recorded that? Yeah, it doesn't matter. It's our best bet. I'll pack. Meet me at the station. We have an inhaler now, which is very big. I'm ready to use it if I need to, but I kind of want to try and I kind of want to try and make it work without it. Okay, that's everything. I have enough food for. What are you doing here? Where is she? Oh. I don't know. Then who are you talking to? Just, just put the gun away. Jesus, you really think I? There are raiders nearby. I, I would never hurt you. The hospital. shot is so gonna go off i'm hoping that this is what makes it hard mode is that we're just not getting a lot of resources i thought we were doing really well with inhalers but then we had to go through all of them bentley i see you on youtube it does it just came out today They're just all dying. Well, she may have gotten away. The otter above him. Otterly tragic. This game deserve better. We're just going. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay. What has Laura done? Why did she do this? I can't. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Laura's definitely still alive. Laura's a hundred percent still alive. Do 
I do not have. I have one inhaler. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm gonna be able to bring the ladder this way though. I'm gonna have to go around. Shoot, bro. That is tough, man. So I need to, I, I feel like I need to clear that whole path. No inhaler. I'm just dead. Oh, I'm so dead. I think we gotta save. Oh my gosh, I think we gotta save. shaking right now. It's dusty. I'm dead. Bro, I just couldn't see, man. I couldn't see. That's okay. That's okay. That was still an insane run, and I think it's saved. We just have no inhalers. No! This is so hard without any inhalers. Oh, that's big. That's big. Dude, I'm going to have a heart attack right now. Is that coming back with these survivors here? Now someone's gonna make a noise and get us all killed. I'm gonna send the hunter. 
What if they're talking about Laura? Under simply repay you with any medical advice. I will not interact directly with anyone in syrup. I cannot risk them screaming last year. I cannot risk leaving care without a mother. This is a long chapter. Oh, this is a cutscene. break? Ah. We're grieving. That is a valid grieve. Oh, because we're behind the waterfall. That makes sense. Now we can be loud. That makes sense. Oh, man. That was a real... That was by far the hardest chapter. The campsite? Dude, I, I don't care. I know we missed lots of collectibles and all that stuff, but... Crazy. Wow, we slept here? We probably didn't sleep. I would imagine we're not getting much sleep. Okay, we head to the riverbank. Goodness, man. 